What's up folks, my name is Felix, welcome back to a new video, this will be another overview on airdrop farming tasks we have to do and I of course also want to give you some updates on airdrops you are potentially farming. We want to start off with Dimension, which everybody is currently talking about. That's why I want to keep this short here. So everyone who was eligible for the Dimension airdrop already got it directly to his wallet. And you are now able to stake it. For example, here on the portal of Dimension, you want to just go to Dimension, click on staking, and then you can choose a validator you want to stake your Dimension token with. I, for example, split my whole allocation in several parts one part i stake with validao because they said they will give out an airdrop to all the stakers and the other allocations i will provide in friends as well as in stake Cedo. they were a little bit late but uh, yeah i didn't stake my token yet but i will do it soon after i recorded this video then the next update milky way just announced that their points program is pretty close and hopefully they will also reward the early users. As Milky Way is soon two months onto mainnet, it would be very much appreciated if they reward early stakers as well. And those people get a point boost. But let's see how they structure their points program here. Then we shortly want to talk about B2 Network. Those guys just managed to collect over 100 million US dollars. So nine figures within the first seven days since the bus campaign is live. And I still think it's under the radar. I was talking about it in yesterday's video, also in the video before. And if Manta managed to get 1.5 billion US dollars in 30 to 60 days with their Manta New Paradigm campaign, then B2 Network as a Bitcoin Layer 2, which is currently in a race with all the other Bitcoin Layer 2s, this should easily go to 500 million US dollars. Mark my words. This is just big in Asia currently and not that much people are talking about it. So get this project on your radar and you might want to take advantage of the current point boost because they will still have a point boost for the next seven days of 1.5 X. They call it a Valentine's promotion. So you can earn more points by now bridging over to this network and get a better position for their future token airdrop. Then Metis launched the season two of the incentivized testnet campaign. You can do that by just coming over to their season page, connecting your wallet. There is currently just one task available, which gives you additional XP, which will later on be important for the token airdrop. Then I want to talk about CK Zinc very quick because those guys now announced more or less it's not official that a gitcoin passport will be required for your airdrop eligibility or will be at least one criteria that's why i can recommend you to go over to their guild page then at first mint one of their guild pins and then do the tasks for the gitcoin passport this is basically a proof of humanity task like linea did it for example as well and i think most of these bigger layer twos or most of the bigger projects will require this in the future so you should definitely do this for a bigger allocation or at least an allocation in your airdrop next up on our list is picasso the restaking project on the solana blockchain they now raise their cap to 150k Solana. So you can now deposit again. You can do that with normal Solana token. You can also do it with all the liquid staking tokens. For example, Blaze Soul or M Soul or Gido Soul. This is completely up to you. Just wanted to let you know that the cap has been raised here. Then Solana Mobile just announced that they extended their snapshot period to February the 8th at 7 p.m. UTC time that all of the people have enough time to change their wallet if they want to because you get the Soulbound token if you ordered one of the Solana phones. And why I'm telling you that here is that I can recommend you to use the backpack wallet here in this case. So first, how do you change your wallet to come over to the leaderboard, click on manage my link. And if you scroll down, you can see the change my wallet button. And here it says Madlads giveaway requires backpack wallet connection. So you want to make sure that you use a backpack wallet for all of this. You can, for example, download it for Chrome, Brave or the Arc browser or also for your phone and then go and change your wallet. Once you install the backpack wallet and connect it to your backpack wallet, best case, of course, you use a hardware wallet and get the Soulbound token to this hardware wallet because it can't be transferred later on and you also qualify for this Madlads giveaway here. To round this video up, I have three simple tasks for you to do if you participated in several campaigns. For example, 
the Polygon ZK EVM campaign on Intrigue. If you completed at least four of six of their campaigns, you can now mint different NFTs. If you completed all six, you can mint the so-called Grandmaster NFT. So you just want to come over to Intrigue and mint those NFTs. Second one is Data Ownership Protocol. They now just released week two of their Galaxy campaign where you just have to visit two pages, do two social interactions and complete this quiz and then you can collect all the points. And the last one which I wanted to mention is the X1 testnet. So the testnet of the OKX exchange. And if we scroll all the way down, you can see you can now mint those rank NFTs. So if you participated in the campaign, this is basically the NFT, your achievement that you participated in the campaign. In my case, I did not all of those tasks because they were pretty annoying. And that's why I just qualified for the golden one. But if you did all of them, you can mint the platinum NFT or maybe also the silver and bronze one. So make sure you mint those that you qualify for future incentives where I'm most likely airdrop, which they will distribute in the future. That should do it on today's overview. If you have questions, feel free to drop them below this video. If you like today's one, it would be great if you hit the like button. That's it. Thanks for watching and see you on the next one.